Hi and welcome in the Lunar Orbital Station or short, LOS. I am your assistant AI and will show you the station and instruct you. We are starting in the large shuttle hangar of the LOS. It is mainly used for passenger shuttles. The large ring is fully walkable and leads to different compartments like the medical room. The maintenance bays are located on the outside of the ring. Both small bays have roughly 100 square meters space. The large bay has room for a ship of 30 meter length and 15 meter width. A powerless ship can be held with the arms in place while it is getting repaired. These three drones are equipped with grinders and welders. They are a modified INX701M drones which were originally designed by Genghis Chan. There are two drone control rooms which also serve as equipment and emergency room. So both can be locked. In the medical room are two med bays and it is directly connected to both hangars. The small ship hangar is split into two hangars which are horizontally mirrored. When the hangar is fully used, there is room for 12 ships. These are equipment racks for the pilots. Now we are heading back to the shuttle hangar so we can enter the core station. The core of the station is separated from the ring by automated airlocks. In the lower part of the station the industrial segment is located. With these panels you can control the hydrogen and oxygen production, the pressure of this segment and also the arc furnaces, assemblers and refineries. Also here you can find most of the storage. Most distant from the living area is the reactor chamber. The chamber is fully reinforced with heavy armor and is always depressurist. Because of the depressurization, the airlock takes its time.
Let us enter the living area. On the first floor you can find a waiting area, a maintenance access, and two additional med bays. Sanitary facilities are also available. The second floor is mainly a extended waiting room with a good view on the ring and the entrance. On the third floor is the actual living area with different rooms and stuff. Here you can find also the showers. This is a large common room which also acts as a collection point in case of emergency. From the bridge all essential functions of the station can be accessed. It also allows the control of the escape pod entrance. With the left control panel you can activate and deactivate every reactor individually. At the right control panel you can find an emergency switch which deactivates the station rotation and activates the backup power. From the main cockpit the captain controls the position and orientation and also the emergency systems of the station. With the right cockpit you access all docking systems. Buttons 6 to 9 extend the large ship docking ports. Button 4 unlocks the arms of the maintenance bay and 5 opens and closes the bay. One controls the shuttle hangar door and two and three the small ship hangar doors. The left and last cockpit is the access point for the defense system of the LOS. You activate the whole system with one and deactivate it with two. Four sets the turrets in kill everything mode and five sets them back to enemy only. Let me demonstrate it. I will spawn a neutral ship. Nothing happens because enemy only mode. 
Now I switched to kill everything. So you can defend even against neutral pirates. In an emergency you want to leave the station as fast as possible. In such a scenario you can use one of four escape pods. They have room for 10 people plus the pilot. You have only to push one to activate the pod and accelerate through the hangar door. It is tight but there is no danger of squeezing through the hole. And now the last part of the station. The solar ring and the oxygen farm. They act as life support system of the upper part of the LOS. The life support systems of the living area and the industry area are completely separated. This makes the living area independent of ice and uranium deliveries. I hope you enjoyed the tour. If not do not report to management or I have to set a collision course with the surface of the moon. Thank you for your service on this station.